Yo, what's going on guys? EJ here. I've got a pretty awesome little video for you here today. So quick backstory. I grew up um, with racehorses in my family growing up. My dad trained them. My godfather, Darren Hancock, is one of the um, leading trainers and drivers in Australia. Yeah, and so I grew up training horses um, all my life pretty much. So it's pretty awesome. So yeah, I'm going to show you a race um, tonight, which my dad won, which I'm really happy for him. Keep an eye out in the race. Number five, tightrope. So yeah. Absolute awesome guys, so happy, and yeah, a little bit of a backstory. So yeah, thanks for checking this video out, guys, and peace, and I'll catch you in the next video. See you. About to run over the 1,720 metres. Inside runner Montana Baron, starters happy they're racing. Montana Baron bounced out well with Superbet in the early stages. It's better me made a line of three and up to make a line of four is Harry Stay Out as they leave the straight. Just in behind those is Future Stride, Tight Rope in the Picks and then Skewbridge Road and settling at the tail of the field as Empty Envelope well, was keen early and as they travel into the back straight now the leader is Superbet. It went to the lead over It's Better Me who works around Montana Baron and they were followed next in by Behind those runners by Harry's Day Out. The picks, the pegs. And then came further back to Tight Rope. And then we've got Future Stride and Skewbridge Road. And last of all is the veteran pacer, Empty Envelope. They come off the back now. And only five lengths from top end to tail. A 7.4 lead time. And that was followed up by a 29.7 first quarter. And the leader is Superbet, one of the roughies that led the way. In second spot is Tight Rope. Third locked away, Montana Baron. And It's Better Me gets a gun trip. One out and one back as they win into the lane for the bell. Back on the inside is the picks, three markers, fifth, and then we've got Harry's Day Out and Skewbridge Road, and the last pair of Future Stride and back with it is Empty Envelope. They greet the judge around to go. Future Stride takes off three deep. Empty Envelope's going to try and get the piggy back home. 30.7 that next quarter. 60.4 the half. The leader Superbet. Tightrope second. On the inside, Montana Baron. It's better me. He's being chased along. And they were followed then by the picks. Further out, Future Stride. Harry's Day Out and Skewbridge Road. And still at the tail of the field is Empty Envelope, but still only six lengths first to last. Down the back straight. Superbet gives back as a side. About to be joined by Tightrope. And then came. Montana Baron, it's better me in the picks. Future Stride continues to grind home, and the deepest is going to be empty envelope as they near the home turn. These two still locked in battle. It's super bet and tightrope, not much between them. They were followed then by Future Stride, it's better me, and to the extreme outside is empty envelope, but still a two horse war on the outside now. Tightrope goes up to super bet, and then it's better me. Followed by Future Stride and Empty Envelope down the outside, but the last little bit coming away is Tightrope. And Tightrope goes home to score. Beats Future Stride, Empty Envelope, Superbet. And then came It's Better Me, followed by Harry's Day Out. The picks together with Skewbridge Road. And Montana Barrett has finished at the tail of the field. Five wins it. Five will be the winner, Tightrope. And that's a double to Gavin Fitzpatrick. He uh, won the first for Father Paul. Got this home for Dennis Upton, owned by DJ Upton, O Upton, and uh, R.M. Devere. There's a Bay Gelding nine by Art Major.